In this video, I'm going to be talking about the three best mountaineering tents of 2019. So what we basically look for whenever we're testing them all out, were how they actually performed, how durable they were, and also the price. And then we tried the best we could to find ones a little bit cheaper, one that's middle of the range, and then one that's more expensive as well. So you can basically kind of go off whatever your budget is. But let's start with my number three pick. It's going to be the MSR Advanced Pro 2. And this is my favorite tent for colder weather conditions where someone needs something that's going to be lightweight but it's not going to take up too much room it's about three pounds to carry um it is super easy to set up and take down and it pitches from the outside one of the best features is that it's super strong and also wind resistant probably the best of the three and probably you know the best wind resistant tent um that isn't you know crazy expensive that kind of thing and then however it's it's not the most comfortable tent and it's not the best in rainy weather so i found it's best in like you know dry cold windy weather but when it comes to rain or wet snow it's not the best option pros um it's small and lightweight it's one of the easiest and quickest tents to set up and take down it has a small footprint and then is strong and durable as well cons it's not the most comfortable tent um especially for two people the ventilation isn't the best and doesn't breathe the greatest compared to other ones. And then there's no bug mesh on it as well. Okay, so number two is going to the North Face Assault 2. And this is my favorite bang for the buck single wall tent since it's quite a bit cheaper than its competitors and it also comes with a detachable vestibule on it as well. It has quite a bit of floor space and headroom as well which is better than the previous MSR in my opinion. And then one of the bigger downsides to it was that it wasn't the best in wet conditions and breathability wasn't the best either. So pretty similar to the previous MSR, wasn't the best in like wet conditions, that kind of thing. Um, let's cover some pros and cons. So pros, it's a lightweight tent. It's got a good amount of space and headroom, more so than the previous one. The ventilation is pretty good and it's easy to set up and take down as well. Cons, the amount of breathability isn't the best. There's normally condensation in the morning and then it's not as wind resistant as others. Those are kind of the main cons to it, but overall it still is a quality tent. But my number one pick is going to be the Black Diamond El Dorado. And this is my favorite mountaineering tent because it's one of the most versatile tents out there. It's great for both cold weather and summer trips as well. It's also the best of the three tents when it comes to weather resistance, so snow and rain. So if you are planning on you know, going out where it's going to be snowing, like wet snow or rain, um, this is definitely your better option. It's not the lightest or most compact tent out there. Um, it's not the easiest to set up and take down as well. Um, but if you do need an all around quality tent, this is it. So it kind of depends on whatever you're looking for. This one's great. Um, it's, it's not the most compact, it's not the lightest, but it is great for like, you know, wet weather. Whereas the other ones are more light and compact, but aren't the best for, you know, wet weather, that kind of thing. So whatever kind of, you know, situation you're going for is what you want to, you know, this is kind of the tent you want. But pros, um, it has a bomber two pole design to it. It's just as durable as some of the higher end tents out there. And then the fabric was as good as any other single wall tent for condensation. Cons, ventilation on this tent isn't the best. Learning how to set up and take down day does take some time. And that's a bit heavier and not as compact to carry around as well. But those are kind of the main cons to it. But overall, again, it is a really, really solid tent. And it's going to be the best option if you are in like wet conditions or that kind of thing. But any of the three are going to be great options. So whatever you're looking for, go with that. But if you would like to see more images, more reviews, or get any of these for the cheapest price available, click the link in the description down below. At the time of the video, that was the best place we could find each of the products. So you can go ahead and check out the current price if you want. And if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And I will just mention our gear giveaway. So if you want to enter in to our 100, 500, and 1000 subscriber giveaway, simply subscribe to the channel like this video and then comment giveaway down below simply do those three things and you'll be automatically entered all right so that's going to be it for the video hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next one